Hello golfers, PGA Teaching Professional Todd Kolb, and today we're talking about how to hit the high soft chip shot. Now first of all, what is that and, and how is that different than just a standard shot? Well, I think the word kind of describes it for itself. I want to hit it high and I want to hit it soft. So typically it might be a shot that we're hitting up over a bunker. All right, a green side bunker in order to get it up and down on a, you know, it could be any hole, par three or a par five, doesn't really matter. But I want the golf ball to come out high, I want it to come out soft. Now in today's example, I'm just talking about a standard lie, nice kind of fairway lie, and how do I hit this shot? The first thing you got to understand, because this is where a lot of people go wrong, is you got to have proper ball position with this shot. Standard chip shot, yes, we're going to move the ball back in the stance a little bit. High soft shot, we are not doing that. We're moving the ball so it's more in the center of the stance. That will allow us to deliver more loft to the golf ball at contact. So that's the first tip. Number one is get that ball more in the center of the stance. The other thing that I want you to be aware of, because a lot of people go wrong here, is I got you to be, you have to be aware of shaft angle. Most people, when they're hitting a chip shot, lean the shaft way forward, and that's fine on a normal shot, but if you're trying to hit it high and soft, when you lean the shaft forward, you de-loft the golf club, it almost makes the shot impossible. So you want to set up so that the handle and the club head are in a neutral position. All right, those two tips go along with the standard ones that we give on all chip shots. Feet are pretty close together, pressure a little bit forward on the lead foot. So. Let's do a quick recap. I want to hit the golf ball high and soft. All right, I got to have a club with a lot of loft on it. I want the ball in the center. I want a neutral shaft angle. And if I go ahead and make my natural chipping motion, that ball will pop up nice and high and soft and hopefully finish close to the cup.